Actually, on the third button, I will put the scissors in a minute or so. Okay. Uh, well, I'm just gonna do it.
faire partie d'une revue, créer ça, sa tenue. 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 Tenue. Faire partie d'une revue, créer ça, sa tenue. Be a glance word. Okay. Okay, so Nina, first can you uh, introduce yourself and the project? Like what, uh, you mean uh, the title and stuff? <laughs> what was the title again? <laughs> um, the choir, okay, sorry. Um, so my name is Nina Boas and uh, I'm working on this 
project called The Choir for now. <laughs> and um, I'm working on an, to kind of like add, um, I just don't really know how to explain it, I guess. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Should I start over again? <laughs> I'm sure this is not going to take five minutes. <laughs> yes, exactly. I should think of my answer. Um, just say what I'm doing now. Okay. My name is Nina Boas and I um, am a performance artist and I'm from the fine art background and I use... Um, live drawing and installation setups with projection live projection of a video and then i um, have the drawings be projected in large behind me and then i interact with the drawings and um yeah the whole idea is this scale idea of um mm, uh, between a very small version and a bigger version and the interaction with these two and um, yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah, my name is uh, Georgios. Um, for this project in general, I work with um, interaction and I make software and hardware for interactive projects. And for this project, it's basically one of the first times I work with video I'm making uh, for Nina uh, a sampler of video and also audio and then I, I've made an interface for her to control playback and sampling and things like that. So um, at this time I'm I'm working so I'm I'm yeah with uh, George's uh, uh, software I'm kind of working on uh, these samples so I, I I make a video and then I uh, with an interface I can play it back or um, make new ones and these new layers come and I think that's quite interesting for me because it's. I'm already working with a lot of layers, the, the drawing, the now, and then the projection, and uh, to work now with this form, it, it can, I can really go back in time, I can um, add new things. For me, it's, yeah, it's a really interesting process. For the festival, I am still uh, developing a performance. It's not very, yeah, it's it's really in its starts. We developed this now in two days and I still need to play with it to really kind of get to know it and to know also what I can do with it. But I, I still want to keep it very simple. It's not going to be much more adding of uh, extra layers in it it's just this is it nina and i started working on this uh project a few months ago and uh it was the first time uh, the first uh, time that nina came to stime and uh, she explained to me that she wanted to uh, maybe capture some of the things that she did. Everything that she did was not uh, based on any digital technology. So the idea of sampling something and then being able to reuse it later in the performance came up. Um, I'm making. A, I've made a video sampler that uh, she can. Uh, use and replay the videos that she made. Of course, this sampler is using, uh, she's able to use many versions of uh, videos what she's created, uh, and many different samples, but these 
create compli creates complications for um, the luminosity and the contrast and all these things. I mean, when you when you mix many images together, um, you have to take care of a lot of things. And um, so for the last three days, I've been uh, trying to automate all these parameters and how it should change according to how many samples are being played uh, back at the same time and uh, yeah, things like this. <laughs> Yeah, so the idea to multiply uh, an image is something that is already um, very much uh, in my work. Like I worked with dancers where them, I had them all dressed the same and then they would be my kind of multiple. And now to actually be able to work with that without having to use other real people, but just to do it with uh, video images, something that is uh, an extension of the idea of this, uh, yeah, and also especially because I, I have this fascination for reviews and this kind of um, big masses of people doing the same thing, like these, yeah, this kind of synchronized movements and um, yeah, it's it's a fas I I find that fascinating and I think that's why I call it a choir because it's also sound based for me now. The idea is that um, I will create a choir, um, but visually based, and then the sound will sound like a choir. So uh, that's yeah, pretty much the idea. <laughs> 